Let's talk about rage quitting. Here are just a handful of many stressful moments from my inglorious gaming career. Now, I've been playing video games almost every day for over 25 years now, and I'm still not even 100% sure I like them, because sometimes they really are infuriating. I mean, look at this. Look at this Assassin's Creed parkour bollocks. Look at that! And so, in the past, I have, I'm ashamed to admit, snapped a couple discs in sheer anger, and also once utterly smashed my phone in rage playing Wolfenstein 2. I was sure I couldn't be alone in doing this, what with video games being so aggravating sometimes, so I looked across Reddit, Twitter, and asked to my community page for all your very worst rage quit stories. I was playing Halo 3 with a friend, someone killed him, and over the headset I heard ah! followed by a mic <laughs> as he literally bit through the cord to his mic. My brother pushed me through our TV when I beat him in Mario Kart. I ninja stared my Xbox controller into my mum's china cabinet. Whoa, buddy. I'm an extremely calm person who hardly ever gets angry. But, when I was fighting Absolute Radiance of Hollow Knight, I kind of broken part of my desk twice on the same day. I thrust a broom handle into PC. When I was a little kid, I got so mad while playing FIFA that I, for some reason, decided to flush a pair of my socks down the toilet. Ah, uh, the first game I've even rage quit, I kicked the tower and slammed the mouse and my dad took it away for two days. The game, of course, being the notoriously difficult Barbie Adventure Riding Club. My brother spent hours creating a Skyrim character. I named him a Big Booty Bitches. And he rage quit the game, chased me around the house. I remember losing the belt on WWE Smackdown Here Comes the Pain, running to my room and choking myself with my hands and doing a Gollum voice. I whipped my buddy in no mercy for N64 so bad that he snapped an N64 controller in half with his bare hands, then proceeded to, no lie, try to eat his own foot. Threw my brother off the top bunk while playing Lego Marvel Super Heroes. My dad rage quit We Fit because it called him obese. I remember yelling to some gods something like, why would you make me suck so much? If anyone wants FIFA 16 for free, just check up and down my street because I just threw it out my window like a frisbee. I, um, I ate a couple keys off my keyboard. Yeah, like, just ate them. My friend took Halo 2 out of his Xbox and slammed it in his dresser drawer, causing it to shatter. Two days later, he asked me if he could borrow my copy. Lost eight games in a row on a Smurf account in a Clash Royale, threw my phone into my TV and told my dog to fuck off. I smashed my Diablo 2 CDs with a sword I got from the medieval fair. I punched my stove after losing a game of Fortnite. Once lost a game of Apex Legends so badly that I turned off the PS4 and just sat there, staring at a blank screen, contemplating the meaning of life. NHL 14. Ejected disc, threw it against wall until broken, took disc outside and stomped it to pieces, took pieces inside, wrapped it inside paper towels, lit it on fire. Any semblance of disc left, I used the garbage disposal on. Bought it again the next day. Damn you, EA! Witnessed my brother rage after losing a Counter-Strike Global Offensive game and he stabbed the table with a pair of tweezers. I was playing Crash Bash on the PS1. I was like four years old and I was losing every mini game. I stopped the game, grabbed the disc and did unspeakable things to it. I was losing a multiplayer game of Halo Reach so badly I tried to smack my leg with my controller and hit myself in the balls. I may have had an anxiety attack after failing the last section of Rhythm Heaven Fever Remix 10. The game was nil-nil and he just rage quit. This is the message exchange that we had. Sorry, my my girlfriend forced me to quit so we could have sex. Dark Souls, those fucking ghosts in Londo ruins. I yelled so hard after getting gangbanged for the millionth time that my own toddler scolded me from her playroom. When I was playing Splatoon 1, I was 12 at the time, I shat myself in anger when waiting for load times. Castlevania 3, Simon's Quest, kept missing one jump for about two days. Took the cartridge to the garage and beat it with a hammer. My brother was killed by a frost troll in Skyrim and he got so mad that he took the game out, bit it in half and chewed it. Threw a controller through the TV my best friend got from his grandma because he forced me to play Super Meat Boy. He didn't even blame me. I broke my head shirt from Rage Quest. My friend threw his controller through the glass door of his mum cabinet. Did any of his mums get injured? With Pokemon Pearl I got stuck in the train station so I got mad so I broke my dispatcher chef. Be me. Be 13. Be playing video. Fail ten times, rip off shirt. Too warm. Fail five more times, slap self and hiss. Focus! Fail three more times, run out of rage. Pass pad. My face when friend who has never played completes mission in one go. My face when 
I was doing it wrong. My friend buried his Halo 3 disc in his backyard. Mike Tyson's punch out. First time I saw in front of my mum, and it was the old mf -er. The amount of screaming I've done playing Call of Duty could probably power Mike Wazowski's world for a day. I do remember doing this once, pointing at my PS2 solemnly and saying, it's not over. Then I realised what a goon I looked like. My ex once shouted, your mum looks like a grain of rice, move! Because a game made him so mad. I hope your family gets gangbanged by a flock of dolphins. Yes, he said flock. You sleep with a teddy bear! Shouted my 14 year old at some other player in Rocket League. Rager, you're all a bunch of fucking bronze lobsters. Me, calm down bro, we got this. Rager, shut the fuck up! Lobsters don't talk. I once shouted, kill me with a sharp stick! after losing a run and gun level in Cuphead, then cried. Received this lovely message after a rage quit. Thanks for letting me record you cheating. I'll be sending the recording to Sony now, so within 12 hours or less, you'll be getting a lifetime console ban, which you couldn't get unbanned from because it lasts till the year 9,999, and EA will know you've been coin buying and transferring coins, so your club will be swiped of everything. Then you're banned from FIFA for life as well. Lemafeo, what an idiot, thinking you'd get away with it. Lemafeo, you're banned, 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 Lemafeo. I bit a door frame. In my immense rage, I threw a handful of cashew nuts right in my brother's face. I went Rage quit a Counter Strike Global Defense game, deinstalled it, ran outside, grabbed an axe, hit a tree stem a few times, went back inside, screamed into a pillow, then sat back down on my PC and reinstalled the game. Some guy got so angry he fucked up his own rage by going, You fucked my mother! Playing a platformer game, doing a bit with no checkpoints, missed the last jump and yelled, so loud, my pressure fell, and I could hear ringing in my ears. Got super frustrated playing Mortal Kombat 10, slammed my fist on the coffee table right on a drinking glass, smashed that, sliced my pinky open, and severed tendons on two other fingers. I threw a steak knife into my brother's thigh when he killed me in Halo. Not quite a video game, but Microsoft Word once made me threaten to kidnap its children. I once lost at Gears of War, so I threw my pad off the floor. It spilled a glass of pot, my XC60 did stop, and I decided to rage quit no more. All we heard was Dylan, why is the TV smoking, before he promptly went offline for a month. My brother broke an entire Wii remote by throwing it across the house. That was our last Wii remote. Children, that was our only ball. There'll be no team this year. Aww. I once rage quit Just Dance because my mum was better at the mashed potato than I was. I think I bent my mouse wires whilst playing Angry Birds Epic. Also, I was screaming like a mountain goat. As a kid, I remember watching my older brother rip the Kaboom cartridge out of the Atari 2600 and drop a concrete block on it. I once rage quit a game and didn't touch it for four years straight. I was literally 30 minutes away from the end of the game. I spat at my TV while playing Skate back in 2007. I was young and stupid, but that fucking Nido King just wouldn't fucking die. Cute yellow Game Boy getting thrown out my second story window into Neighbour's Pond. Playing Mario on my Game Boy, tried to throw it across the room, missed so badly it bounced off the wall next to me, hit me in the face. Yeah, I'm a chaser. I'm chasing that high of playing Halo 3 Pit Stop in 2007 and getting so mad I chucked my Xbox controller into my brother's head, denting his soft skull. I smashed, well, angrily yet carefully took apart, my Lego Star Destroyer after losing in the first round of an arms tournament to someone who exploited the system to get seeded low. The guy then had the audacity to friend request me, Scholamojay. Well, having read all these, I do feel a bit better now at having petulantly rage quit so many video games. Lastly though, to prove that it's not just video games that evoke such a reaction, as a 15 year old Christian camp volunteer, I once rage quit Risk and told my leader to go fuck himself. This has given me an idea for a follow up video, literally as I sit here recording this now, Board game rage quits? I have certainly flipped a Monopoly board or two in my time. Any board game rage quit stories of your own, if you've ever smashed a chess set with a shovel or anything, please pop them in the comments. Thank you and goodbye.